Hi, I'm Dr. Michael Rett, State Senator for Georgia's 33rd District, and I'm here to give you another update from the Capitol. Don't forget Senator Rett. The Senate adjourned sine die for the 2017 legislative session around 1 a.m. last Friday morning. It was a productive session for the General Assembly this year with 2,388 pieces of legislation being introduced in both the Senate and the House. I'm very happy to let you know that two bills I sponsored this session have been passed by both chambers and are now on the governor's desk for his approval. First, Senate Bill 15, which passed almost unanimously in both chambers, authorized retired disabled law enforcement officers to obtain a free weapons carry license if they have served for at least 10 years or left their position due to an injury suffered in the line of duty. Senate Bill 15 also requires that law enforcement officers comply with other stipulations regarding the weapons carry license. Our local law enforcement does so much to protect us on a daily basis. They participate in rigorous weapon training throughout their tenures in law enforcement and providing them with a free weapons carry permit after they retire is the least we can do to show our appreciation. Another bill I sponsored, Senate Bill 202, passed the Senate on February 28th. Senate Bill 202 would have increased the personal needs allowance for medical assistance from $30 to $70 per month for individuals who are institutionalized in nursing homes. This bill in its original form did not make it out the house, but I wasn't ready to give up on it at all. Since we were nearing the end of the session and Senate Bill 202 was not moving in the house, I worked with Representative Trey Kelly to add my bill's language to a piece of legislation in the House Bill 206. We can do this because both Senate Bill 202 and House Bill 206 fell under the same code section. I am thankful to Representative Kelly, Kelly and the Senate and the House for passing this legislation that will make the lives of Georgians better. Although the 2017 session has come to an end, my work representing you is not over. I enjoy having the opportunity to serve Senate District 33 under the Gold Dome. If you have any questions or any concerns, please reach out to my office and I will be happy to talk to you. Thank you for your continued support and don't forget Dr. Rett.